If your life depended on naming the largest insects in the world, would you be able to name them? Of course, dragonflies would be your first guess. But do you know that there are insects large enough to give the griffin fly a good fright? Here are the largest insects in the world. Number 10. The Titan Beetle At first sight, you'd think it's a large cockroach until you take a keen look at it. Measuring up to 6.5 inches long, the Titan Beetle is considered the largest beetle in the world in terms of sheer body size. As scary as it looks, this beetle is very shy and secretive. It dwells deep in the Amazon rainforest, and not even the scientists have seen its larva. But that didn't stop them from knowing the larva size. Based on the size of the boreholes of the trees, it's been estimated that the larva can grow up to an astonishing foot long. Like all beetles, the Titan beetle's larva feed on decaying wood below the ground and stay their adult life without eating. They depend on the food consumed as larva. How cool is that? Since it's shy and constantly hides from humans, people tend to misinterpret and think it's not harmful. They may not be aggressive, but the sharp spines and jaws it possesses to defend itself when threatened are strong enough to cut a person's flesh, let alone dent a plastic ruler. With all that, one fun fact is that these creatures must launch from a tree to fly because they're so large. Sadly, its wings cannot take off from the ground. Number 9. Atlas Moths Who'd even thought that moths would be on this list? Well, on the account of their huge wingspan and surface area, the Atlas Moths deserve to be on this list. Hailing from the tropical forest and shrublands of Asia, they're the largest moths in the world, featuring a wingspan of up to 11 inches and a wing surface of about 25 square inches. Their size is an advantage to the people of Asia as their cocoons are occasionally used as purses for pocket change. This bird-sized atlas moth has the most disproportional body size of its species. Like the titan beetle, the larvae of the Atlantis moth are very enormous. The length of a normal caterpillar is almost 5 inches and weighs as much as 2 ounces. As soon as it becomes an adult, its purpose is to find a mate. After they've bred, the females lay eggs. They say goodbye and join the afterlife. Number 8. Midas Flies Yes, it's a fly, a big, enormous fly. They're medium-sized to very large flies, measuring 9 to 60 millimeters in body length, depending on the species. It's considered to be among the largest flies in the world. They're recognizable with their striking, velvety black wasp-like long antenna, smoky wings, and a bright tinge of orange marking at the side of their abdomen. They're mostly based in the arid and semi-arid regions of the world. Though the fly may look intimidating because it resembles the wasp, it has proven to be harmless to humans. They mostly feed on nectar and caterpillars, making them fantastic pollinators. They're masters of flying, but mostly appear clumsy when they fly because their legs trail behind their abdomen in flight. Quite a funny sight to watch. Number 7. Queen Alexandra's Birdwing for the butterfly collectors, this is a gem you can find in Papua New Guinea. When we think of butterflies, it's common for our minds to flit to the tiny colorful butterflies that fit on the tip of our index fingers. As for the tiny butterfly, it stands out and it's considered the largest butterfly in the world with a wingspan of up to 12 inches. As for the body, it doesn't measure more than 3 inches long. The species was named in honor of King Edward VII's wife, Alexandra of Denmark. Its rarity and status can fetch a single specimen for a price with several thousand dollars on the black market. The first bird wing ever was found taken down using a shotgun. The male and female are marked differently, with the male having more bright colors, a shimmering emerald green-blue color with black stripes and veins, while the female has a dark brown color marked with rows of white spots and triangles. The bird wing was listed endangered on the IUCN because of habitat loss due to deforestation of the rainforest to make room for oil palm foundation. Number 6. Giant Weta Without looking at this insect, you could tell just by its name that it doesn't amuse the eyes. In the indigenous language of Morai, the Weta means God of the Ugly Things. Whoever named it must have had a huge resentment against it. It's endemic to New Zealand and its surrounding offshore island. 
The enormous insect grows up to 4 inches long and weighs up to 1.2 ounces, roughly the weight of a typical sparrow or mouse. Since it looks like a big cricket, it's easier to assume that it can fly when the truth is that they are too heavy to fly and are decidedly earthbound. They're considered at risk of extinction due to the introduction of rodents to the island during colonization. The rodents caused the numbers of the Wettas to reduce at an alarming rate. They were at risk of extinction until the government stepped in to protect them. When it comes to defending themselves from predators, they don't hesitate. They tend to use their sharp, spiny legs when threatened. Number 5. Tarantula Hawk Wasp It's normal for humans to be afraid of insects. But for a spider to run away in terror, things can't be good. Meet the insect behind the spider's worst nightmare. This is one of the scariest looking insects ever and also the world's largest wasp measuring 2.7 inches long with a wingspan of 4.5 inches. Its name comes from the fact that it's brave enough to hunt tarantula spiders. The tarantula spiders become the food source for their massive larvae. What they do to spiders is quite brutal if you ask me. The wasp stings its prey to paralyze it before hauling it off to its nest. When in the nest, it lays eggs on its prey. The egg hatches to a larva and eats the prey alive, like a pre-prepared dinner for offspring. If that's not savagery, I don't know what is. The tarantula hawk wasp has blue-black bodies and bright rust-colored wings with long legs that hook the claws for grasping their victims. As for their sting, it's not to be messed with. Their sting is considered one of the most painful insect stings in the world. The pain resulting from it is second only to that of a bullet ant. Their aggressive nature has earned them to be classified as least concern on the International Union for the Conservation IUCN list. Number 4. Stick Insect As you would have guessed, the insect has a spindly, flat tube-like appearance that resembles an actual twig. It measures about 22 to 25 inches long and consists of over 3,000 species found mostly in subtropical, tropical habitats. It holds the Guinness Book of World Records for the world's longest insect. They often mimic their surroundings in color, thus no constant color for identification. This helps them camouflage with the very branches and leaves they resemble to hide from their predators. At times, they even wield mossy outgrowth and spines to make the camouflage appear extra convincing. They're the only insects in the world who can regenerate limbs. Since their limbs are stick-like, they can easily break off when held by a predator. Not to worry though, the breaking is a defensive strategy known as autonomy and the insect will regenerate the missing limb the next time it molts. If that's not enough, they're also one of the rarest insects that can reproduce without males using a process known as parthenogenesis. Number 3. Giant Water Bug Also known as electric light bugs, toe biters, or Indian toe biters, the giant water bug is a carnivorous freshwater insect. It's generally found in freshwater ponds, slow-moving ponds, and marshes, and can be mistaken for a beetle or a cockroach at first sight. They can grow up to 4.7 inches and are considered to be the giant of all bugs. They have large, four-leg pinchers that are used to catch underwater prey, like small fish, snails, frogs, and sometimes even snakes. They use the ambush hunting strategy to seize their prey, then inject them with unique poisonous digestive juices. Occasionally, they bite humans' toes when disturbed especially by swimmers, resulting in them being called toe biters. This fierce predator has a surprisingly sensitive side that was noted during the hatching period. They practice an unusual form of parenting for the animal world, where the female deposits eggs on the male's back. Then he trundles around with them, keeping them moist, clear, and safe from predators. Like a daddy daycare until they hatch. Isn't that adorable? Number 2. Goliath Beetles You can't miss this one. The Goliath beetle is considered to be one of the largest insects, and with that name, there's no need to argue about that. It's recognizable by its striking and unusual patterns and markings on the backs and abdomen resembling skeletons. As for colorization, that depends on the different species. The beetle measures about 3 to 4.5 inches long and weighs about 3 ounces. Quite heavy for an insect, don't you think? But that's nothing compared to its larva stage. As a larva, 
It weighs about 3.5 to 4 ounces and reaches almost 10 inches in length. This makes their larvae the heaviest insects on Earth. These beetles are native to the tropical rainforests of Africa. Like their namesake from the Bible, they're very strong, carrying loads of up to 850 times heavier than their weight. The adult beetles feed on sweet things like tree sap and fruits, while larvae feed on rotting wood in the wild, rich in proteins. Number 1. Hercules Beetle Just by knowing its name, this beetle proves that it deserves to be not only on the list, but to be our number one. Named after the famous hero of Greek mythology, this enormous species of rhinoceros beetle is one of the world's largest flying insects. It's native to the rainforests of South America, Central America, and Caribbean islands. It measures up to 7 inches long and weighs over 3.5 ounces. Its appearance is unmistakable as it has claw-like horns that may be as long as its body. The male has two horns, one comes from the animal's thorax, while the other one is shorter and comes from the beetle's head. The horns are used to fight against other male beetles to get a mate. The winner gets to mate with the female beetle. The most unique fact about this beetle is that its larva stage lasts about two years and features three different metamorphosis stages. Like Goliath beetles, they have strength like no other. It can carry up to 850 times of its mass.